Happy 3rd of December, everybody. It's great to see you. We're going to go straight over to Avion to find out the next exciting name for Jesus. Son of God. Thanks so much, Avion. And what a name again, isn't it? So many exciting names for Jesus. The Son of God. I don't know about you, but I get this all the time. When I go somewhere where my dad is known first, I walk in and I, I could tell whose son you were. I got my dad's nose, I got my dad's hairline. I look like him. We use the phrase, isn't it? A chip off the old block. You are just like your dad. And that's the same with Jesus. Jesus is just like his father. We're not going to talk about today the, who the father was married to or anything. He's not his physical son, but he is someone who he loves and he's one with. And he pours out love and life on Jesus all the time, every day. And Jesus says, I don't speak any of my own words. I look to the father and I speak his words. And the father looks on Jesus, his son, and says, I love him so much. Listen to him. They're inseparable. You can't like split them up you can't get them apart they're the same same desire same words same love same life that they share together which makes the verse amazing John 3 16 for God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son God has given you the best that he had the Christmas time he was giving his son the one who he loves not just money or a card to sort your life out he has given you the best he's given you jesus the one he loves so take that into your day today jesus is the son of god and you have been given the best that god could afford to save you mm -hmm.